what's up, y'all? We, oh, hold on. Ah, that that's better. Hey, what's up, y'all? I'm at the Pilot Travel Center in Kansas City, Kansas. So last night I delivered to a place in Shawnee Mission, Kansas. I don't know why that's hard for me to say, but Shawnee Mission, Kansas. Um, I was there for eight hours. <laughs> and uh, yeah, uh, apparently they forgot to call me. Um, you know, yeah, they, uh, they had the paperwork at like 3.45, I think they said. But I ended up leaving at about 8.45 because they never called me. They, it's just paperwork just sitting there on the desk, and they never said anything. So anyway, the nearest parking to there with free parking, as far as I know, um, was the Pilot Travel Center in Kansas City, Kansas. Uh, if you do get parking, uh, reserve parking at this Pilot, uh, it's not the usual rate. It is small, it's just a small, cramped, just always clustered at any given time of the day or night. It's always full. It's always clustered. Um, yeah. And they have two fuel pumps that are down over here uh, next to the clean energy pumps, which is right next door, which is kind of what this video is about. Um, I don't know if anyone knew this, but the parking at the clean energy pumps, uh, well, I'll just put it this way. It's not parking and they're starting to boot trucks for it, uh, for parking on their property. Um, here, I'll, I'll show you. Yeah, so, um. There's a sign over here. It says, warning, park at your own risk. Trucks will be booted by clean energy. This area is not owned by Pilot. Now, this is a fairly new sign. Uh, there was no sign before, but... Uh, yeah. Uh, Towaway zone, private parking. Unless you have business with this company, you will not... Uh, be allowed to park here. Uh, I have never parked here before. I have come in to turn around, which I don't think there's a problem with that. But do not park over here because uh, they are serious. They will boot your truck. Now, I, I think one form of booting, as they say, is. Uh, putting this thing over your windshield to where you cannot see. It's on the driver's side. Another way of booting is, of course, booting the tire so that you can't go anywhere. You have to pay to uh, get unbooted. But, uh, yeah, this is a tow-away zone. They are serious. Now, uh, this guy... King Transportation. He's been here since... Oh, he actually has a pink uh, sticker. Huh. Yeah, I was about to say, he's been there a while. This other guy over here, the flatbedder, uh, he's been there. All right, well, he, he actually hadn't been there very long, but he just came in. Hopefully he doesn't uh, go in there and park. But uh, this is what I meant by Pilot Travel Center being uh, always clustered and what have you, but, uh, but yeah, Swift, he's been there for quite a while as well, but, uh, yeah, this over here, I've only parked at this, uh, Pilot Travel Center for, uh, a few times, uh, this spot right over here, just so you know, if nobody's ever been here, or maybe you just didn't know, um, this is reserve parking right next to the scale, Reserve parking is $20. Um, 
Yeah, this is a common occurrence for it to be this clustered like this. And uh, these spots weren't open when I uh, came here. I actually had to pay for parking, which I would have paid less for parking if I would have went to a uh, smaller truck stop that was closer. But I thought I could get a spot, and I was wrong. Um, but, uh, but yeah. This is... Um, This is a common occurrence at the uh, Pilot Travel Center in Kansas City, Kansas. And usually it's a whole lot more, uh, well, a little bit more cramped than this. Now this one, they actually have two pumps open. On the other side, it's only one. Wow. Wish I could have shown up when all these spots were open. And what's up, Camby? Uh, yeah, last time I was here, came in the middle of the night and parked right here where Schneider is. But it's it's also common for people to park right over here on the side road, even though there's a sign that says no parking anytime. Uh, oh, uh, yeah, that's right. I have parked over here before, too, when I drove for Prime. I was, uh, Bobtail. Parked over here in Bobtail Parking. They have Bobtail Parking, and they have regular parking. Um, I think it kind of sucks that Bobtail Parking actually has more spots than, uh, regular, but, you know, what can you do? And that's where I'm at. Right over there in Reserve Parking. I'm on a 10 hour break right now. Yeah, so if you're ever going to the Pilot Travel Center in Kansas City, Kansas, just know it's cramped. Your backing skills will be tested. <laughs> Although it's not really much, you just gotta have a little patience and persistence. Uh, don't give up too easily. Just because it looks hard doesn't mean it actually is. Stick it out and think about it and just kind of map out what you're going to do. But, uh, yeah, so here we are. I know I just got in the truck, but I, I want to do an in-store tour of the Pilot Travel Center. Yeah. And also, I didn't know this, but they have washers and dryers. And a little place where you can uh, pay for it with card, but I'm not sure that's working. Take a little sneak peek. Ah, okay. TV, kind of like a lounge in here. And uh, I think that's a prayer rug. Yeah. Okay. I got dish. So that's, uh, that's pretty cool. And a camera. Okay. Well, that's basically the full tour. What's this? Okay. Let's check out the bathroom. Okay, so there's nobody in here, so I'm able to do this. It looks like a fairly clean bathroom. 
Flushing large amounts of toilet paper will flood. Okay. Call that a imitation urine novelty kit. Yeah, imitation. That's why it's forty five dollars. <laughs> So anyway, uh, that was the tour of the store. I really didn't talk much as I was going through there because I didn't want it to make it more uncomfortable for anybody. It's like some guy walking around with a camera and giving commentary on everything that he sees. Uh, I guess it just uh, would make me look like a crazy person and everyone else would be like, you know, so I didn't do it. Um, but uh, I would say over, you know, overall, it's a it's an older truck stop, and it saved my butt on parking quite a few times. But uh, it's just a pain to navigate and to to back up in this place. Um, right now, the pumps are under construction. Usually, they're not. Um, but uh, anyways, so oh, and another reason why I come here. Uh, this is usually something I forget until I get here and get parked and I'm like, oh yeah, they have good Mexican food. <laughs> um, I got what the person in front of me actually got, which was a steak bowl. It's basically beef and whatever else you want added in there. Um, it's, uh, it's pretty good. I, I got beef with, um, uh, rice and refried beans threw in some cheese some pico de gallo um sour cream and verde sauce and it's pretty good it's pretty good anyways y'all take it easy be safe keep the shiny side up and rubber side down and remember do not park at the clean energy uh site right next door to the pilot in kansas city kansas all right peace